Pac-Man, Cloud, and Isabelle. Starting off the Dr. Mario versus Pac-Man. Generally, even in terms of the play, um, and actually, Arcoon bringing it right to even with and taking the lead on percentage here. Solid back and forth going on here. Uh, game guy having to take the lead again. That hydrant coming out, take the hit, but the up smash coming out. Nice quick up smash there by game guy, taking out stock. Arcoon bringing out the young hook now. Pac Man living from that down air. Trying to get the up B kill. Arcoon just throwing out the jab there on shield. Shield pressure on, and the down air will take the stock there. Um, coming into the second stock with Cloud for the guy. Well, these two were talking earlier about uh, the kind of different strategies that they're trying to apply with the characters. Here, though coming out will take the stock, leaving it all up to Roy. The question is, will he be our boy today? The up tilt just barely connecting there. Um, I'm getting the side B out. Going low, trying to get that fair kill. I could really look to try to just finish the stock up as quick as he can. Oh. Yep. And launchy up be that uh that wasn't able to punish. will kill. So, only 49%. Arkin definitely can bring this back. Game of Kai trying to try his own. Back is fair. Back is out, and that actually will do it. Get the guy banning Yoshi Brawl in my light again. They seem to be his uh go-to bands. Squad strike. Same team setups, jumping into game two. Let's see what the pick order is, though. Young Link first this time. All right, Pink Guy not changing up his order any.
putting the pressure on, really just trying to get use his range to take control of the hydrant. Um, Trades here, uh, but Genki Guy has taken a bit of a lead here. Arkun doing a good job though, keeping right up to pace with them and uh, taking back over to uh, help with himself. But Genki Guy also keep right up with them. We got a key pawn deck. F smash. Ooh, just this key. Back here will come out. Taking that pill, but um, the armor on that side beat, armor and active frames on that side beat. But the tornado will come out. Take it, okay. Arcoon actually getting the breakaway damage first, and I'll be coming out. And he'll will gimp that, uh, leaving it down to only the Isabel to take out both the Black Mario and the Roy. Does take out the Dr. Mara of only 36%. Per so he definitely can. Uh, do it. essentially here, but doesn't mean much if Geek Guy can get a night just a clean snipe back air. Uh up there. Throwing out that F tilt. Trying to get the stop sign. Not working yet. There he goes coming out though. Just jumping over that blocking the fishing pole, fishing rod. Nice parry there by uh, 
game from Guy. But good patience on Arfu. We'll just wait and watch what our game from is doing. And he's gonna hook the ledge. Water Tail coming out, and the back air will do it. GameCube guy taking game two. GameCube guy trying to get that reset. Arcoon trying to get his first win <laughs> of this set. All right, looks like we're seeing the same team um, that we've seen before. We got Young Link against Pac-Man. Yep. Looks like though we actually have a bit of a diff an order change. Uh, he picked Roy second this time. So. Oh, excellent. Well, that'll definitely change up the matchup uh, coming after this battle. But we have to see exactly. Uh, stock first. And Arcoon looking like he's kind of he's taking nice control of the match so far. Um, he's just he's doing really well with this projectile game. He's out um, spacing Pac-Man who um, from first hand experience has a very excellent uh, oh, yeah. projectile game so it's got to be really good about dodging weaving in and out of all these, these hydrants these, these fruit. Sometimes a key is in there. Yep. Well, yeah, he's, he's doing really good yeah. with these, his bombs, his, uh, his boomerang. Our grab there. He's just looking. He's playing more patient, a little more patient this time around. Um, I think last time he was trying to push a little too much Ooh, against Pac-Man. That was a great yeah. down air. That time he just played a little more patient, um, put a lot more projectile game in, and it got his punishes a lot cleaner. All right, let's see if uh, Cloud can power through. Doesn't have the projectile game, of course, but um, it's very fast, very strong. If you don't, if you least expect it, you're definitely gonna get knocked off stage and far. But Arkun's definitely handling himself really well, just keeping space, making Cloud come to him, which is, of course, a bit tricky. Yeah. It's a bit tricky, but it's what he needs to be doing. Oh, I didn't get that. Uh... I don't know if he was at the high enough percent for. Another good grab. Yep. That uh, boomerang into grab. And ooh. Yeah. He was able to um, pop him off the ground again for that forward smash. But let's see how the Isabel. Arcoon being able to get back on stage rather cleanly. Yep. But uh, having a hard time hitting that Isabel. Yeah, no. Uh, game you guys, Isabel's been doing well with the bit of spacing and. Uh, just trying to kind of play stay away, but this is also against a young Link where he will also play that game if you're not careful. So yeah, yeah those arrows just completely outrange um, Isabel's little pushing line grab. Yep. Ooh, nice. Snuck in that forward tilt for an easy kill. All right, but out comes the Roy now. I, mean, I, think, I don't think we've seen the Roy Isabel matchup yet. Have yeah, we? we've we've seen it a couple times. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, he was. Game he was guy actually won both of them with Isabel. So he's got the high percentage now. He's really got to look out. Roy can hit pretty hard if he uh, can close that distance. Yeah, oh, and, and that, that might be it. Yeah, just just like that. One clean read, uh, getting the side B combo in there, finishing it out. Arkun now on the board. Uh, one, two. Let's see where we're going next. Uh, looks like I'm going to have to go check these guys out really quick. So. 
I'll solo comment for the next little bit and see what see how they're doing. Where is the Alright, okay. looks like we have the same setup. Looks like even the uh, same order as last time. So we got a young Link and a Pac-Man. This is uh, game four, grand finals. Three, two, one, go! All right, looks like they're getting their projectile game out. Hoping to get that uh, fire hydrant to be on his side, but Pac-Man seems to be able to knock it away before Young Link can knock it with his bow. Ooh, very clean down air. I think he's just been nailing these combos. Just keeping that damage up while keeping his space away. Let's see if he can keep it up. Ooh, very nice block against the strawberry. Ooh, escorting him right off to the edge of the stage. You gotta be aware of those, those kinds of attacks. If you're not careful with your jumps, you're definitely going to be sent to the edge. No hope of escape. See if Roy can clean this out before Pac-Man can strike up all this damage. He's, he's got a good combo game. And so far, uh, GameCube guy has just been really clean with his, his Pac-Man aerials and his, just getting those hits out. Just being relentless. At this point, one good strike, he's gone. So all Roy has to do is close that distance. Ooh, but the orange comes in. Knocked him straight away. You gotta be careful of those fruit. You know, I hear I hear apples are supposed to take at the doctor, so keep them away. Just the, uh, should use an apple there. Now we're seeing Cloud again, and... Though he's one stock up, he's still got to fight against that Dr. Mario. He's got a, he's got pills. He's got very strong attacks. Let's see if Arcoon can keep, keep Dr. Mario through this fray. He's doing a really good job of keeping the pressure on the cloud. Just kind of being wary of each other right now. Ooh, almost got that grab. Gotta be aware of that limit break, though. Long, wrong move. Ooh. Rolled underneath it, though, and... Oh! GameCube guy makes it back. Ooh! Smacked him with that forward smash. Very fast. wary of each other. Just waiting for the next for the right person to strike. Ooh, and the back air, and it looks like the reset has happened. Excellent. Looks like the bracket is going to be reset. We're going to start off with the next set of five. So we can set this up. Alright, it seems our stage has been picked. We're 
going to be seeing the same characters we've been seeing this whole set. It appears so. So it looks like our new set will be coming in. Oh, you can change them, like... Three, two, one, go! Alright, um, Linky here commenting again, um, just trying to set up some stuff so you know everything's going smoothly. We're in the last bracket of this grand final set. Right now everything looks pretty even. We've got Young Link and Pac-Man, pretty familiar with this matchup. Trying to get that Hydrant, but he just leapt over that little guy. Says no to the orange. He did not want to die this time against the orange. Got another good clean up B. That uh, spin is nasty if you get caught in it. Doing a good job at keeping the pressure. That very high percents could be anybody's stock at this point. One wrong move, one well placed move, and. First. Ooh! Through the shield. I think the shield was just small enough for that Hydra to blast through. Can Arcoon make it back? One hit and that Pac-Man is done. But that Pac-Man just does not, does not want this game to end. He wants to live on to the very last. He wants to fight that Roy, but can it be enough? Pac-Man still makes it back to stage rather smoothly. Very good with this fire hydrant game. Ooh, and a very, very delicious bunch of combo, combo coming towards from that Pac-Man. That fire hydrant can be dangerous, especially paired up with uh, paired up with those fruit. If you're caught in the middle of that. Ooh, very nice, very nice cape from Doctor Mars, from Mister Arku. Uh, Cloud hoping to get that kill, but just shoot it just in time. Now can now Arcoon is trying to keep the pressure on. He definitely is at a high percent, so he wants to make sure. And he's already already gotten a very close game here in the very. It looks like Cloud with a very clean kill. Two of the two great swordsmen against each other now. Let's see if fire can be. Well, I guess I don't know exactly what Cloud has. He's kind of got that wind effect with his blade beam. Clean grab. Very clean parry. Oh, just not enough for that forward smash. And even Arcoon was able to sneak in one of his own. Now it's just down very last characters. Let's see how Isabel fares against this Roy. It's been a very good matchup in Isabel's favor these last couple of matches. So Arkun was able to take that one game. So he had somebody else fighting Isabel, so let's see if Roy can keep up. Isabel really good at keeping playing keep away. 
whereas Roy is an entirely up close character, you definitely need to close that gap as soon as you can, or else. What's the point of playing Roy? Playing it very safe right now. They're in very dangerous territory. Oh! And a clean back air from GameCube guy takes the first game of the set. Okay, looks like they are doing their band picks now. The GameCube guy is sticking with his usual Yoshi Brawl Lilac. Looks like we'll be seeing our six favorites this grand finals. Sticking with the tried and true. We are into game two, the last set. Starting off with Three, Young Link two, and Pac Man. Again, you just gotta be careful of those projectiles that Pac Man is spewing out. You get stuck in the middle of any one of them and be the difference between 10% and 100%. has been doing really well with outspacing Pac-Man in addition to damage, but a hard time getting through these fire hydrants. GameCube guy's just doing a really great job of playing keep away, keeping Link away from anything that can hurt him. Just doing really well, shielding, jumping over these projectiles. Scott with that forward smash, but he did manage to grab another one right after and successfully. That ghost is rather brutal if you allow him to hit you. Ooh, and the hydrant. A little hydrant roll across the stage. Solidifies the stock. Now Arcoon has a large disadvantage. He's about a st full stock down. Still got plenty of fire hydrants to deal with, and is he gonna score him to the stage? Doesn't look like it. He needs to get those hits in with Dr. Mario. Or... Oh no. The bane of most Smash players' existence. That wrongful air dodge sending you out to the depths of death. Let's see if Roy can change. Very clean with that up B, but not enough to get the Pac-Man. He's gonna repeat with a combo of his own, get trapped in that hydrant. You guys have been doing really, really well this match. Just play a keep away. Making sure that nothing standing between player and his projectiles. A good clean grab on him though. Waiting for that up B kill. Looks like that'll do it. Now we're out of two swordsmen. Let's see if Roy can turn this around. Both need to be up close and personal. Got those large disjointed hitboxes to be the difference. Arkham's doing a really good job at keeping that cloud on his toes, though. They've almost matched up. Oh, and that'll do it just far enough away for Cloud not to make it back. Unfortunately, no limit break to save him this time. 
This Isabel has been quite a nuisance for this Roy. Let's see if we keep that up. Arkun doing a really good job at getting the damage up with Roy. Very short amount of time he was able to take care of Cloud and not only get Isabel. Oh! And a well-placed forward smash. That'll do it for game two. Now everything is all tied up. That was an amazing match. Let's see if GameCube guy can keep the pressure that he's been keeping up for most of this time. And I think we'll be seeing the same setup as before. Tried and true. So let's hopefully see. We're gonna have any different different order this time. Uh, looks like we're gonna start off with Roy this time instead of Young Link. Let's see how that'll affect the Pac-Man matchup. Pac-Man can definitely keep that distance, but Roy definitely has very powerful. He's very fast this game. A lot of the Fire Emblem Swordsmen have that advantage of being very, very quick. Being able to jump in and out of the battle with very relative ease. Harpoon is doing really, a really good job at making sure that GameCube guy can't set up his, set up his tricks. Gotta watch out for the, that fruit. It comes out of nowhere. In the hands of a very great Pac-Man player who knows the attributes of everything. So you know, a really good job at making sure that the right fruit for the right situation. Ooh, going in for that tricky, tricky forward air off stage. Grab. Ooh, and the air dodge. Again, that air dodge is brutal if you if it's not hit right or hit at the wrong time. It'd be the difference between life and death. Roy's just doing a really good job at keeping that cloud off stage. A lot of pressure, but he was able to you know, well placed down air, down, down smash off. Arkun is saying no. Ooh, and a will. That was very well done. Let's see if Dr. Will, Dr. Mario will give Cloud his prescription. Do a real good job at Oh wow, two back airs in a row. That's got a very dangerous aerial game. grab. Just a game of cat and mouse. Just waiting for the waiting for the bait. Almost got that up smash off though. Very good grab. Dr. Mario's uppy is just super strong. It's like almost sure you can levels of strong. You just punched him real hard and just send him flying, but now Isabel's gonna try and keep that pressure going with her with her slingshot. Make sure that all she's doing is dealing the damage. If Dr. Mario can get in. Arkun's doing a really good job at avoiding most of these slingshots. Closing that gap. Just like that, we're almost at an even match on the very last stock. You gotta see this Isabel pull something off. Uh, both balloons, unfortunately, but Isabel was definitely hit, so she's able to make it back. She's at a very dangerous percent. 
That back air was super clean. Super nice. Fortunately, Isabel has kind of a disadvantage, so the, the right hit is all that's needed. Unfortunately, that down smash will do it. Game two goes to Ark. Very great matches from these two so far. It's been about even for the most part, almost to the last man standing. I think they're sticking with their tried and true. They, they don't want anything to change coming into these last few games. Looks like the setup is going to be the same as last match. Arkun's Roy was doing a really good job at keeping that Pac-Man at bay. Let's see if he can do it again. Trying to set up a trap there. I definitely fell for that at times in my matches against GameCube guy. It's a very clever tactic. But already we're at 63%. Roy, that fire is just too much sometimes. Okay, look at that hydrant. Very good grab. Ooh, and a very, very clean counter from Arku. so great to see the counters like that very well placed but cloud is just he's using that aggression that pac-man had didn't want his stock taken away he's telling the cloud bro you got to look out for me and we'll get that forward smash off but not finish it off with the back air almost gets the limit break klim hazard is what it's called but it's not enough. Roy's almost there. It's definitely, uh, Gimpy Way's definitely spacing himself out really well with Cloud this match. He's, he's making sure that uh, those hits, um, Roy can't get in with his close range priority. Because Cloud can still dish out the damage no matter where it is on his blade. Arkun just getting those bread and butter um, setups. He's doing a really good job at getting this damage up by it. Very clean forward tilt from GameCube guy. This cloud. The return of the Doc. Doc has been doing really well against this cloud so far. Able to keep the distance and Wait for the cloud to strike. Ooh. It's gonna be really close. Keeping his distance, making sure he's not staying near the ledge. He doesn't want to get struck by anything the cloud has. Just trying to make sure his spacing is good. And with that, cloud is gone. They're down to Isabel. The dog and doc. Very clean combo there. Gotta watch out for those broomsticks. They can just be stuck up in the air for just a second if you're not paying attention. Isabel's doing a really good job at making sure it's not getting hit by anything. Just the little things, whereas Dr. Mario had a hard time trying to get those hits in. game. It's not over yet. Anything can happen. Oh no, it looks like the pills disappear before the Lloyd come, comes out. It's like, why do, why do you get those? 
vitamins all to yourself, Dr. Mario. Trying to go for that forward air, but his bill is unfortunately on stage. Unable to get that spike. Very clean spike there. It'll bounce off the ground. Almost got it, but Isabel's still alive. Ooh, and the spike with Isabel, and we're down to our last characters. Let's see if Isabel can close the gap. Clean so far. Just let go of shield a little too early. Always be cautious when it comes to, especially Young Link and Toon Link. They got those, they got those recoveries that get you stuck in there. was in the high hundreds that high percentage and that does it Arcoon takes the set and our grand finals winner is Arcoon